Hello everyone, today is a sad day. We're on our way to squash for the last time in we don't know how long. So pretty much overnight Australia is like cracked down on the coronavirus and all like gyms. What? Gyms, indoor sports, cinemas, restaurants, cafes, bars, everything like that are uh, closing down from 12 pm today. And we don't know when they're going to reopen. So this is our last hit of squash for we don't know how long. So that's fun. How do you feel? <laughs> sad. Yep. We both feel sad. Because there's only so much squash training you can do off the court. Like, if you don't have the squash court to actually play squash, do you know what I mean? You can do like home workouts and squash specific training and everything like that, but there's no, we don't have a gym and no squash courts. And the news is saying it could be for up to six months, but fingers crossed it's not. of days later since I filmed those last clips and I just wanted to sit down and have a little bit of a chat about what's going on pretty much as most of you know squash centers are closed at the moment in Australia and pretty much all around the world I'm on a few like squash forums on Facebook and it's pretty much the same case everywhere in the world there's only like a couple of countries where squash courts are open same thing with gyms and any other indoor sport as well so we're definitely not the only ones affected but it is hard i actually really feel for all the professional squash players at the moment uh none of them would have an income at the moment if they don't have some sort of side income because yeah the world tour is currently on hold at the moment and none of them are playing it's good to see the squash community coming together trying to stay positive posting home workouts and squash specific workouts and everything like that which is kind of what i wanted to touch on as well so i'm hoping to post more home workouts and squash specific training but i just wanted to say i probably won't be posting too much squash content here on youtube for the next i'm not sure how long and i think you guys will all understand that because obviously pretty much everyone in the world is in the same boat right now but yeah here in australia they're saying it could be up to six months or more so we're really having to get creative with how we train and even though i am just talking about squash i know that everyone in the world is affected it's not just squash players it's a whole lot of other sports and they've even just announced that the olympics has been postponed till next year and yeah pretty much every sport is affected and most people are affected people are losing jobs people are getting their hours cut and yeah it's just really not ideal at the moment and everyone knows that pretty much everyone is going through a similar thing which is kind of nice in a sense because everyone around the world can understand what everyone's going through at the moment like the uncertainty of the future and the fact that we're pretty much all stuck at home so i'm really glad that we have things like youtube and social media these days because it is really helping everyone to connect and get through this together i can't actually imagine going through this without social media or without phones in general being able to talk to family and friends and connect with people on the internet i think that's really special so we do have a whole lot to be grateful for and i am really grateful that i do have a roof over my head at the moment and i'm with my family and i have food to eat and i'm safe and i'm healthy and yeah i hope you are all safe and healthy too and doing okay if any of you do need to talk feel free to reach out hopefully we'll all be back on a squash court before we know it but until then, we'll keep sharing workouts and squash specific training and everything like that and get through this together. Anyway, that's about all. Sorry, this video was a little bit boring. I just wanted to update you guys, let you know where I'm at. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now. Bye.